Yurt. You already know what it is. Welcome to another episode of In a Tommy Fashion. It's your boy, Divine, aka Vince Starter. It's starter jacket season, baby. We out here to fall. Has officially begun. We outside again. Yes, I'm here hugging trees. Hugging trees. <laughs> but um, yeah, yeah, we got a beautiful episode for you this week. Um, man, we're gonna get into the sneaker releases. Uh, we definitely gonna get into a black brand. I'm gonna introduce y'all to a new black brand. It's been a little minute since I've done one of those. And yeah, yeah, fashion news or whatnot. So you already know what you gotta do. First off, you gotta like and subscribe. I need y'all to take a second to like and subscribe, please. Second taken, cool. All right, um, as always, I need you to sit back, relax, find a tree to lean on, <laughs> and take in some of this dope. You already know what it is. Okay, okay. We are here, we're gonna do sneaker releases for the week coming. Uh, if you haven't noticed the last video, I switched it up because I put out my videos later in the week and I don't want y'all to miss an opportunity of getting sneakers that are already released. So now I'm gonna give you sneakers that come out on the weekends and days a little, couple of days after. So you get a chance for it to come out. Uh, let's get right into it. Starting off, starting off we have dropping October 2nd, October 2nd, Jeremy Scott by Adidas Forum dipped Signal Orange and also dipped Blue and a dip till. We know Jeremy Scott, he always has the crazy collabs with Adidas. And uh, he actually kept this simple. He normally added some nice funky twists to his sneakers with Adidas, but he kept this one pretty simple. He got the old school forum look. Um, the colors, colors are interesting. I think if I had to choose my favorite color out of them, it would probably be the, the mint till situation. Um, yeah, yeah, I, I'm personally cool on these. It's not really my thing, but if you rock with them, cop up if you can. Oh, sorry, these are dropping for 160. 160 of them things, these are dropping for. But cop up if you can. Keeping it in the Adidas family, we have the Simpsons Adidas collab. This is the Simpsons by Adidas, McCartan, Ned. Flanders, Ned Flanders, yes. Adidas has been doing this collab with the Simpsons for the past couple months. Uh, I think they had like a Quickie Mart one, you know, they, they've been dropping all these different ones. So now they're doing Ned Flanders, you know, the infamous Ned Flanders character. He's like the nerdy guy with the, the vest. As you can see, this is a shoe fit for Ned Flanders. They got the green representing the vest, the brown for the undershirt, I and mean, they got the pink situation. Uh, these, are, these are going for 120. The sneaker is pretty clean, it's pretty clean for, for what it represents. I'm not mad at this, uh, for what it represents. I could get these off, it's a casual shoe, kind of gives you that, that boat shoe feel, you know, Sperry type of vibe, but it's a sneaker. These are kind of cool. I like the, the hint of pink in the sock line. I like that, I like that. Again, these drop uh, October 3rd, October 3rd, $120. The Ned Flanders. <laughs> Ned Flanders, IDO neighbor. He say that all the time, uh, Ned Flanders. <laughs> all my Simpson heads out there. Moving on, moving on. Next we have, next we have dropping October 5th, we have a Nike Women's Air Zoom Fire White Volt. Nike Women's Air Zoom Fire White Volt. Uh, these are going for 110. Going for 110. Uh, this is obviously for the ladies. Clean little trainer. You know, this is something I could see women working out in, but this is something that I could see women dressing up real nice. Like, you know, throw these on with a little Wale pair of pants. Um, throw these on with a nice little, little after work suit. I don't know. You know, I think that'll be kind of dope. Yeah, y'all definitely would like to see how the women gonna style these up. These are, these are kind of clean. I'm not mad at these at all. Again, drop in October 5th, October 5th. Jordan Zion 1, Bayou Boys. Bayou Boys, you know the Bayou. Hey, baby, you know, I New Orleans, you know, hey, baby, we out here. We out here. I mean, these are dropping for $120. Um, this is Zion Williamson, signature sneaker. And, uh, it's a cool little colorway, kind of got that, that gator, got the gator material in the back. 
I seen what they did here. Um, and the different greens is like an olive green. I think they're calling it carbon green and asparagus. Uh, so that's interesting. But of course, the Bayou, the gentleman in New Orleans, you know, he plays for New Orleans Pelicans. So it makes sense um, with the gum bottle. Cop these for 120. I'm cool on them. It's not really my thing, but I'm not mad at you if you cop these. I'm not mad at you. Uh, for 120, October 6th, cop up if you can, if you can. Moving on, next we have Clot by Saka by Nike LD Waffle, Kiss of Death 2. Kiss of Death 2, these are dropping October 7th, uh, retail 170, 170. Uh, this is like the third, what is the, the third uh, Saka by Clot situations that they dropping. Um, I'm not mad at this colorway. I'm not. This is all right. I wasn't a fan of the actual sneak the LD waffle due to the whole soul, how it's so thick in the back. But these I, I rock with. I rock with the other ones too. That it was the orange with the red and this cool gray with the gum bottom. I don't know. Something about gum bottoms that just does it for me, especially when nothing else in the sneaker has anything to do with the gum bottom. It just goes well. So yeah, clot still doing their thing you know clot had the kiss of death one which was a air max one that was the first kiss of death uh collab that they did yeah i'm not mad at these at all i'm not mad at these at all cop up if you can cop up if you can next we have uh of course if we talk talking sneaker releases for the week we can't talk about them unless we're talking about a what and air jordan you're right you're right uh october 7th air jordan 5 women's bluebird Women's Bluebird, this is a women exclusive uh, exclusive sneaker. Dropped it for 190, 190. And this is just like a powder blue situation on the fives. I think this would be dope for the ladies. Um, if some of the guys wanna cop up, you know, do your thing, just do them right. You know, um, this is it's not my cup of tea. I'm cool on these. I love the fives though. Five silhouette is definitely dope. But uh, yeah, I'm cool on this colorway. But I'm not mad. I would love to see what the ladies are going to do with this. I just, I just want to say, please, please, if any of y'all cop the powder blue situations, don't get a shirt that's the exact powder blue. Like, all that matchy-matchy, you know, here, at the time the fashion closed down, we don't really condone that matchy-matchy. But, you know, let it coordinate, let it coordinate, you know. You can have some fun with these, though. Definitely, definitely. And uh, that's how we're wrapping up sneaker releases for this week. Wrapping up sneaker releases as always. If you cop up on any of these, please hashtag close down on Instagram uh, or on Twitter, wherever you decide to post it at. And uh, if not, just DM me. Let me see some outfits that y'all y'all rock with them. And uh, leave in the comments. Tell me what your favorites of this week. What you plan on copping? Yeah, that's when we're gonna wrap the sneaker releases up just like that. Moving right along. Moving right along. Okay, told y'all we bringing the black brand of the week back. And uh, this week, it's a black brand from a black woman. Uh, the brand name is Reese Levu. Reese Levu, uh, I had the pleasure of actually meeting this, this black designer. Um, very dope, very dope. Uh, she, has, she has everything from, you know, sweats, biker shorts, hoodies, she has bathing suits and she does couture made to measure situations if you need that. And she uh, she gives styling services too. So all y'all out there, y'all need that. She does that too. Whole situation. But um, yeah, it's definitely dope. She has a line uh, called Bike Bike Bay. It's Bike Bay by Reese Levu. Uh, really dope situation for the biker chicks out there. You know, um, all of that. And uh, she, she, she's a, a, a big fan of the Jeep gang, you know, she, she, she Jeep gang and all that. So she definitely has like a Wrangler Bay shirt, I think is really dope. And she, she shows a lot of love to the, to the whole Jeep culture. Like that's a real thing. Um, that's, that's, that's dope though, I think that was dope. But um, yeah, let's get into some of her pieces that she got. Get into some of the pieces that she got going on. Okay, first up we see, uh, we have this situation right here. Again, the bike bay. This is the bike bay hoodie. This is the orange situation, uh, reflective hoodie. This is dope, going for 65. 
Uh, she also has a, a yellow a yellow joint, has cyclists up there. Dope, yellow. Yellow hoodies are so hard to find. It's a good yellow hoodie. This is this is dope, this is dope. Um, again, 65. Uh, she has the, uh, she has a, a, like a varsity jacket. This one actually sold out, but she has some of them on, on her Instagram. Looks really dope, has the bike bay up there and all that. Uh, yeah, yeah, varsity jackets. I seen one that she uh, premiered yesterday that she's showing. I don't know when it's coming out, but definitely look out for that. That joint look, it look definitely looked dope. Um, next, she has the baby suits. Like I said, she has the baby suit situation. She has this two piece situation. It's called a reversible string kini. It's a uh, licorice uh, jet black. It's like a look like a patent leather situation. This is fire. It's a little thong 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 the thong 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 for the ladies. I see y'all out here. Uh, she has the one piece situation. This is dope. This is dope. Both are going going for ninety. Both going for ninety. Not mad at this. Um, the Starburst pinky joint is tough too. Yeah, this is cool. And uh, this and, and again like. She also does couture dresses, couture dresses, which fire, it's fire. You know, she, she's, she's a, a, a one woman band. Like she just does it all, you know, all services. She knock them out for you right there. So definitely go follow her, go follow her. Uh, show love to site. Go go check out some of the, the different clothing. And uh, you know, it's fall time, grab a hoodie or something. You know what I'm saying? You know? It's uh, definitely dope. Reese Levu. Shout out to you. I see what you're doing, man. I see what you're doing. Gotta, we gotta, gotta create an interview. Gotta, gotta set up an interview for you. You know what I'm saying? Uh, get you in front of the camera. But uh, much love to you. I see what you're doing, girl. And we gonna keep it moving. Moving right along. Moving right along. Okay, okay. We here for fashion news of this week. Fashion news of this week. So uh, earlier this week, or yeah, earlier this week, the Yeezy Knit Runner sulfur color shoe came out and uh yes yes these banana boat looking situations um they were trashed trashed and you know per usual yeezys gets trashed in the beginning and then everybody go copy you can't find it anywhere they made a big thing about it all on social media all the comments tweets even marcus jordan got into it uh he he was talking about oh yeah these look crazy whatever you know all types of jokes and everything but as always you joke on it you're still gonna get it it's easy i'm cool on these but i say that to say like these retail for 90 dollars 90 dollars but then you go on goat and you see them going for 688 dollars for some ugly sneakers that none of y'all mess with that's a wild price why the price so high if y'all don't mess with them because these look crazy right this is what i'm saying man like everything is hype beast up and all that like i i'm cool on the copycats like what's up with the the air xeroxes because that's all people doing they, they copying things just because somebody else got them they they they, they doing i don't they just copying we ain't even gonna say copying anymore you copying that's all, that's all you're doing and it's getting corny y'all talk all this trash like oh yeah uh, i would never get those you won't catch me in those da -da. they did the same thing with them yeezy um sandals matter of fact was it easy? Yeah, the Yeezy sandals. They talk crazy about them on the internet. Now they bootlegging them. Everybody's trying to get them. They drawing all the fam. Stop, stop. They did it for both of them sandals. The uh, the joints with the holes in them too. Like, which one is it? Which one is it? Y'all rocking with them or you're not? But again, if the if the hype beast gang get a get a hold of it, then y'all all on board. But you know. I digress, as they say. Uh, keep it in the Yeezy family. Yeezy Gap, you know the Yeezy Gap collaborations coming out. They decided to drop a couple of hoodies. Well, put hoodies out for pre-order. They didn't actually drop them because that's what Yeezy can do. Yeezy can apparently put out stuff, have it sell out, and it doesn't get shipped for another three months. And it's okay because people are still going to do it. Uh... But yeah, they got, got these hoodies. And um, 
Yeezy got these hoodies. Has a black situation, blue, a red, purple, light brown, wheat brown situation. Um, I don't know how these are gonna fit. I need to see how these are gonna fit before I, I, I start going crazy talking about them. Um, looks like they're gonna be a little baggy. I'm cool on a baggy. And, uh, but if you mess with them, you're gonna pay. You're gonna pay resale because they sold out. As soon as they put out the pre-sale, it was game over. Uh, but if I had to choose a color, purple, and that that brown, purple and that brown is tough. Uh, I like the colors of those. But nonetheless, Yeezy Gap hoodie. The collab is coming. Full force is gonna drop. And I'm pretty sure they're going to probably do like a restock on all this stuff when it actually drops and hit the stores. Everything can't sell online. Like, that's just crazy. I'm pretty sure they're going to do it. Like, everybody going crazy for it now or whatever. they probably going to do a restock when they actually put it in, in the stores physically. So, none, nonetheless, wait. Relax and wait. You'll get your chance. But uh, that's how we're wrapping up fashion news for this week. And uh, that's how we're wrapping up the show wrapping up the episode that way as always i need y'all to first like and subscribe if you haven't take a second to like and subscribe second taken cool follow me on ig follow me at divine and conquers also follow me at close down and follow the other show at across the board show and follow the podcast at board underscore head underscore thoughts oh your boy's out here he's doing what He's on TikTok. I'm on TikTok. Follow me on TikTok at 386Divine. And I can make you chuckle a little bit. I'll make you laugh. You know, I'm to do a little comedy thing. Uh, so follow me at Divine's Kind of Funny. Divine's Kind of Funny. Funny. Um, so, yeah. You already know how I'm going to end it off. It's only one way to end it off here. I am not a stylist. I'm just stylish. You already know what it is. Holla at your boy. One, two, piss. You get into the bag. Stay dangerous. Stay dangerous. Spending all that cash. Stay dangerous. Stay dangerous. Yeah, they talk behind your back. Stay dangerous. Stay dangerous. Never let them see you lack. You gotta keep it dangerous. Stay dangerous They'll line you for a bag Send a dime through for a rack That's how the slimes do when you act You gotta stay dangerous and that's a fact You send a dame to us, we send a bat You know we done stained the up and it's a wrap Think shit sweet? Stop assuming nigga, wipe to the right She'll boom you nigga in a purse the banger said she gon' ride for it. Could tow the gangster, took a OT, runner with the jets. Ask her what she like, she said money, drug, sex, bet. She keep the thing in clutch.